Oh my goodness, we are back. Maybe. So, if you have not been in the know about what's been going on with Tarkov as of late, well, a lot. They have been having backend issues, they've been having server issues, overload. Somebody mentioned a DDoS that may be occurring. I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't really seen anything about that. But at the very least, their login servers have gotten so bad that there is now a queue in order to log in to play the game. Uh, I had to wait about 20 minutes to get in, and this is not the first time that I've done this. I have tried to record a few episodes over the past few days, and every single time that I would log in, I would get in there and I would start moving things around or I would start getting prepared, and then I would get a back end error, which immediately throws you back out into the queue. And it's just been a mess. So I'm hoping today we are at least stable enough to be able to get a couple of, you know, a good raid or two in. Just something, anything. I feel as though I have just been hamstrung by all of this, but so is everybody else, let's be fair. So today I was able to get a couple of uh, scav raids in just to kind of keep, oh, they added a 30 minute AFK timer basically, where if you're 30 minutes AFK in game, boots you back to the main menu and you are back in the queue. So, in order to circumvent that and be prepared for the inevitability of recording this, I did a couple of scav runs, and as you can see up here, I came out with some stuff. Not bad either, huh? Some good stuff. So, I think we're going to take this Vepper 209 that we were originally going to take out, and we're just going to slap those two little bits and bobs onto it. So we're going to take that off, we're going to take that off, we're going to put that on, put that on. Oh, wait, oh, yep, nope, this right there, there we go. Beautiful. It's still ugly, it's still rocking FMJ once we go and purchase some, but at the same time, we at least have something interesting. So we'll go ahead and sell these real quick. Uh, the rest of this stuff I will worry about organizing later. I'm still pretty sure that this is all full. Oh no, I actually have a little bit of room. Wait a minute. Oh no. Okay, it's still there. Good. I'd actually moved some stuff in there earlier. And then I got a back end there and it all reverted again, so... I don't even want to actually touch anything, I just kind of want to play and s just hope that something good occurs here. So, Prapor, we need to buy... It's not from Prapor, who has it? Mechanic, do you have the... Ammunition that I need? No, who has it? Skier? There it is. So we have one, two, three, four... Okay, do 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 Reload. There we go. Oh, there's stacks of 50. Oh, that's all right. We'll go ahead and just put that there. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I don't even think we're gonna get rid get through that, honestly. Uh I took Dorm 206 in my last video that you never saw because I got, you know, booted out as soon as it went to hell. Uh, but the plan is to go for Operation Aquarius. Although it's going to be kind of rough because right now people are still camping out the tree and such. Alright, Elimination Interchange. Wait, what did that give? M62? Ooh. Eliminates gas from a distance of more than 40 meters on Interchange? It's possible. Survive Reserve. Cricket lighter, turn in. How many do I have? I have one. We're not going to hand that in. We're going to see if we can get another one. Well, I was able to find a propital, which is fantastic because now we can do the dehydration words. But I'm not going to do that on customs. That is for sure. What else do I need to bring in? I need to bring in some extra maracasions. So we have the Selawa. We have a painkiller. And now we have a cat. So that should hopefully keep us going. I don't think we need much of anything else. Let me just see if I have any other tasks on customs that I need to accomplish. Does not appear to be the case. All right, so my main thought process here is we're gonna go to customs, but we are not gonna go directly over to the dorms. We are gonna let things kind of settle for a while. 
Actually, thinking about it, if we can, do we have room? Ah, uh, I kind of want to bring the director's key too, but I don't have the space. We're just going to take the... We're, we're, we're taking that key. It'll be fine. Alright, so... And maybe we do an evening? Let's do an evening, just to... Maybe... You know, maybe less people are going to be coming there. Don't need to ensure this. Uh, we'll ensure everything else. Alright. Let's see what we got going on. Yeah, it seems like there's not a lot of people loading into the evening map, which is good for us. So let's go ahead and pop in and see if we can finally, after what feels like a week, escape from Tarkov. Oh. Oh, what a terrible spawn. You're gonna stick me right next to the dorms. I could have, oh God, no, don't rush it, don't rush it. Follow the plan, stick to the plan. We have a plan. Plan is to try and survive. Give me, give me, give me, give. We're just going to take our time. Have a nice, relaxing raid back. First one in feels like forever. And then, we will slowly make our way to the dorms. Slowly. I fear how out of practice I am because I've been playing a lot more Hunt Showdown. Two completely different fighting styles. Surprised I didn't run into him. That must have been who was shooting up there. Well, more power to him. They can have up there. There is nothing that interests me. Thought I saw somebody. What? Хуйло! Вот хуйло! Конец тебе! Really? Already. I don't even know that I'm here. I don't know if they're shooting at me, actually. No, they're shooting at the Mosin guy. There's double Mosins. All right, we're we're moving and grooving on out of here.
These guys can all do whatever it is they're doing. We are not messing around with Mosins. My body armor could not handle that. It was the Santa! Are you kidding me? I can't believe it. I... Oh my god. Are you serious? Dude, they gotta give some sort of warning that it's Santa. I would not have shot it if it was him. But somebody is just rushing it. What do you expect me to do? Oh my... Oh, this game. This game. <sighs> All right. Very well then. <laughs> Very well then. All right. So now, now that we know that that's the thing that's happening, let's go ahead and take our 105. I think it still had. Yeah, I got this guy right here. We're gonna take this guy right here. Let's grab a helmet and a tax sport. This can go down with the other meds, because I have the grizzly up in there. So we got the AFAC. We will take another one of these and another cat. Oh. Why did Santa have to be there? I didn't want to shoot him. Momex. Uh, yeah. So, that sucked. Alright. <laughs> Let's grab a backpack and I guess we'll just head back in. It wasn't that dark, so we can still go back into the evening one. I think we're okay to go back into the evening for now. We should be okay. I think I have everything that I need. Yes. Alright, let's get back in there. <laughs> And hopefully this time we won't get bum rushed by Santa Claus. Okay. This time we're just gonna straight rush the dorms. We are just rushing the dorms. Hopefully this time Santa won't be there to cause us distress. Or if he is, we notice him before it's too late. I'll be honest here. I don't think I want to stick around for the entire raid. If I could just get over there, get it, get some experience, spend a little time, just enough to not be a run through. That would be good.
Ooh, okay. Thanks for the sugar. Here, have some sugar. You gonna trade me? Oh. Gee, thanks. Here, have some Apollos. Oh, okay, bye! Yo? Yo! Alright, I will be leaving then. My bad. Ah, uh, you're good. I'm just here for Aquarius. Okay. <laughs> uh, Santa's outside, by the way, so be careful. Don't shoot him. Alright, well that's good. Man, I just have a, I just have you're good. A you're good, bud. Please, man. Ah, uh, you're good. Thank you, bro. I really appreciate it. I can go this way. In a medic car. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Everybody's trying to do their missions at night. <laughs> Understandable. All right, so we do need to venture on and get a couple of kills or something just to get a little experience so we can get out of here. Nothing in the trunk. Ooh. You know what we could do? We could go around, hit a couple of the guys over at the checkpoint, and then leave. Seems perfectly viable. In fact, maybe we'll go up here. Just see if there's anything worth scooping up real quick. Can't believe Santa left me high and dry like that, though. I guess there is a limit to how much he's willing to trade. Grab everything, we can sell it off. Alright, so we got a Mosin out there. Cool, cool. This is what the world has become. You have to run night to do the early game missions now. There's apparently a new metagun. It is a UMP. Which is really surprising considering the fact that the UMP in the last patch was like 
just frowned upon. Hey man, I'm just trying to do a quest, bro. I'm just trying to do a quest. Yep, you're all right. But thank you. I'm heading out here too, so. All right, so we'll hit these secret stashes and then just get out of here. Chunky. Is that at me or was that at him? That should be enough to get out of here, but I'm still out of pure greed. I'm gonna go check this. Is this a good rig? That's a good rig. Let's get out of here. Complete Operation Aquarius Part 1. You! Yeah, you! Fuck you! You heard! <laughs> he is so aggro. <laughs> ah, I love it. Alright, so we completed a quest. Huzzah! And now I think we may try for a daily. Maybe we'll go over to, maybe we'll go over to uh, uh, interchange. Maybe take that SKS over or something and just see if we could pop some scavs from distance. I'm not gonna play too much with moving things around and adjusting and all that stuff, mainly because I'm nervous that if I do that, I'm gonna get that move error and it's just gonna boot me back to menu. So, Instead, we'll just do this. We'll grab the SK. We'll grab... I had a small one here. There we go. And we just need ammo now. Let's see here. PS, there we go. Okay. Don't need the dorm key anymore. In fact, we could just sell that thing. Put that there for now. Alright, so trading... Therapist finished. Part two, eliminate scavs on customs. Fantastic. All right. So how many did we need for interchange? We need four. We need four. All right. We can handle that. Maybe. Am I good with that gear? I'm good enough with that gear. That's fine. Uh, interchange, 10 in the morning. Insure you. Not really caring about that rig. It's a yeah. It's a small rig. I think we're good to go. All right, let's see if we can get some scav kills from a distance. From a distance. Very well. I guess we will not be doing this particular daily. Perhaps we should try. I don't know, maybe we'll try the reserve survival. Let's try that. Okay, reserve was doable. Not really sure what I'm gonna do here though. Uh, 
my extract points on here, we have everything. We're just going to kind of go around, re-familiarize re ourselves with this particular map since I don't come here that often. Generally for good reason. There's usually nothing worthwhile for me to do here. I mean, that's not true. There's always, you know, raiders and whatnot, but, uh, I don't really have an affinity for going after raiders. Alright, so... Put your helmet there, put on the Bastion. Seems like a worthwhile trade. Yeah, measuring tape and yellow pliers. Trying to keep myself out of harm's way as much as possible. G desk key. Oh, I just realized I have crud. I have the, uh, one of the marked room keys for here. I think it's massive. Holy crap. Just taking random things at this point. Not entirely sure what my plan is here. It's super quiet, though. It's only mildly disconcerting. Bunker Hermetic Door Cliff, Scav Land, Sewer Manhole, Armored Train, D2. Do I have... I do have the bunker part one here. Okay. So I guess technically we could go and start working on that a little bit. Okay. Not entirely sure what that was. Probably don't want to know. Wonder if that's a new scar. that may be slightly safer than the alternative. I don't know where that guy is, but uh, adventure, guess whatever he is shooting is going to just completely shred my armor. Whereas I am running PS rounds. I don't think I'd be able to compete.
Here, BP. Nothing else. Yes, my friendly sprats. There we go, and then we'll keep the sprats for later. Should there in fact be a later. Helmet there. Yep, do that. There we go. Cool, cool. And now we can try to make our way underground and see if we can survive long enough to exfil. Gonna loot and scoot along the way. Very first thing we drop is that. That's above us. Sight or grip. What are the prereqs for this one? Look at the underground bunker, look at the control room. Survive an extract. Well, he booked it right the hell out, didn't he? Hello. Must have left because they didn't have a big enough backpack. Oh, okay. Fucking terror group. Did not mean to hit that. I'm fudging my buttons here. Okay, the control room. Hmm. Ah. Gotcha. I think he may have heard me coming and got the hell out of Dodge.
where he reclosed them? Huh. Yes, please. We'll always take a 35 round SKS mag. This guy may or may not be exit camping over here. It's so hard to tell. Or well, those feet may have been above us. So, going in under the assumption that this guy just booked it on out of here, looted on the way, this door is probably open. Yep, alright. That is fine and dandy, because we need to get out of here too. He seemed so displeased by the fact that he was surviving. However, we just completed not only a regular quest, but a daily as well. So I think that's a, I think that's a win. Now we're going to go and complete the quests and not touch anything while I exit out of the game to make sure that I have a save state that I can return to and then do all the back end stuff and hopefully not lose everything. Cause I really don't know what it's like. Ooh, that gets us some Iglenik and some BT and an AK-105 that is not hot garbage like mine. Exciting. Uh, who had the other one? Not you. I guess I could just go character tasks operational. It is, excuse me, Mechanic. Which we're getting a TNT brick and a muzzle brake, along with 31,000 rubles and a little experience, along with a, just a tiny boost. Tiny boost of mechanic. Not bad, not terrible. We are getting closer to le unlocking level 2 therapist. That is going to be nice. We're going to start being able to get some better meds. And eventually we will have the flea market. Which, hang on. Ah, okay, 15. So they, they brought it down to 15. That's good, because I remember the last patch, it was 20. Well, it's not great. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But this guy should sell quite... In fact, I want to see real quick. We're going to risk it. We're going to move just that. We're going to go over to you. 
Let's see how much that is selling for. 51000 I bet you it's more on the flea market. I bet you it's more. But with that in mind, I do believe it is time for me to pause. I thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you on the next exciting adventure. Adios.